Penn State is a very renowned education program. They um, set up their teachers to succeed. KSU always has had an excellent reputation and tradition for their early childhood education program. Right now I have over a thousand hours in the classroom already before you know, just as a graduate. I feel as though I have gained valuable information and resources to become a successful teacher. When I graduated, I felt like a prepared teacher. Kent State offering the IB PYP certificate for their early education students is a great opportunity. There's very few, I think there's actually 10 colleges in the world that offer that certificate. It gives them an advantage that many students aren't going to have, especially in the United States. But the primary program is just best practice teaching. So whether those students end up in teaching in an IB school or not, they are learning best practices that they can take into any school. Kent's program is based on this inquiry-based learning where children give input into what they want to learn and how they want to learn. And IB's philosophy is the same way. They're about inquiry and child-centered based learning. The International Baccalaureate program has four different programs. PYP is the primary years program. The primary years program is pre-K to typically fifth or sixth grade. The PYP program benefits children because it is teaching them to be problem solvers and inquirers. Um, it's teaching, it's taking all the best practices and kind of holding it all together. I've learned that it allows children a new way to think and a new way to learn. It's discovering and it's giving students opportunities to find them on their own rather than just speaking at them. We're not just teaching to race test scores but also teaching um, in ways and planning our instruction in ways that um, the aims are geared towards meaningful learning experiences. I don't see my students as their scores, as standardized tests. I see them as someone who can discover what they're looking for. They can find answers themselves, they can ask questions. In my Block 4 classroom, we did a lot with the learner profile attributes. Um, reflective, caring, open-minded, um, and there's other ones. And we presented the attributes in a way through books and literacy and read alouds. I was in a kindergarten classroom and I would read a story and for five and six year olds to be able to sit down and talk about a main character being in a choir or being reflective or a risk taker. It was really inspiring to have such rich conversations with five and six year olds. You know, reflective and open minded and principled, those are big words for kindergarten students to use, but they really started to grasp the idea and as they began to learn how to read, they would pull those attributes into the characters themselves. They'd, well that's not a very friendly lion, he stepped on the mouse. There's many components to IB PYP. Part of it is action, so having students um, take action outside of school, within school, but rather than um, teachers saying we're going to do a bake sale and raise money and give it to this charity, we're asking the students to come up with those plans. International mindedness means that kids are open to new perspectives. They're open to new possibilities, new cultures. It helps the students to learn about these cultures and it helps them to be more accepting of the people around them. Teaching the kids not to just think about where they are, but the whole world and what's going on and how those people are similar yet different. The PYP program is important to me because it's a unique way for students to learn. It's a unique way for them to explore the world around them, get used to you know, being inquisitive and thinking outside the box. My expectations now are really to, for children to develop their own learning. Rather than me just teaching, I want them to be curious about the world around them and to wonder why and really investigate the world. So I want them to um, develop that passion in life and really evolve their thinking around that. As IB came to become a part of um, my teaching career later on, um, it really was an easy fit for me because of several ways that Kent State had prepared me.